Welcome to Daily Scripture Reading. I do not own the rights to this music. John chapter 9, beginning at verse 13 and ending at verse 34. This is the Amplified Version. Controversy over the man. Then they brought the man who was formerly blind to the Pharisees. Now it was on a Sabbath day that Jesus made the mud and opened the man's eyes. So the Pharisees asked him again how he received his sight. And he said to them, He smeared mud on my eyes, and I washed, and now I see. Then some of the Pharisees said, This man, Jesus, is not from God, because he does not keep the Sabbath. But others said, How can a man who is a sinner, a non-observant Jew, do such signs and miracles? So there was a difference of opinion among them. Accordingly, they said to the blind man again, What do you say about him, since he opened your eyes? And he said, It must be that he is a prophet. However, the Jews did not believe that he had been blind and had received his sight until they called the man's parents. They asked them, Is this your son, who you say was born blind? Then how does he now see? His parents answered, We know that this is our son, and that he was born blind. But as to how he now sees, we do not know. Or who has opened his eyes, we do not know. Ask him and stop asking us. He is of age. He will speak for himself and give his own account of it. His parents said this because they were afraid of the leaders of the Jews. For the Jews had already agreed that if anyone acknowledged Jesus to be the Christ, he would be put out of the synagogue, excommunicated. Because of this, his parents said, He is of age. Ask him. So a second time they called the man who had been born blind and said to him, Give God glory and praise for your sight. We know this man, Jesus, is a sinner, separated from God. Then he answered, I do not know whether he is a sinner, separated from God. But one thing I do know, that though I was blind, now I see. So they said to him, What did he actually do to you? How did he open your eyes? He answered, I already told you, and you did not listen. Why do you want to hear it again and again? Do you want to become his disciples too? And at that remark, they stormed at him and jeered, You are his disciple, but we are disciples of Moses. We know for certain that God has spoken to Moses, but as for this man, we do not know where he is from. The man replied, Well, this is astonishing. You do not know where he comes from, and yet he opened my eyes. We know according to your tradition that God does not hear sinners, but if anyone fears God and does his will, he hears him. Since the beginning of time, it has never been heard that anyone opened the eyes of a person born blind. If this man were not from God, he would not be able to do anything like this, because God would not hear his prayer. They answered him, You were born entirely in sins, from head to foot, and you presume to teach us? Then they threw him out of the synagogue. The end. God bless you, and thank you for joining me today.